Congresswoman Susie Lee was down here at Lake Mead and Hoover Dam today. Now, she's a Democrat. And she was joined by Republican California Congressman David Valadeo. Now, she says this bipartisan trip was important to highlight just how vital Lake Mead and the Colorado River are to both Nevadans, Californians, Republicans, and Democrats. Take a listen. One of the pressures with respect to the Colorado River is the tension between urban users and agriculture users. So it will be incredibly import important and insightful me for me to go out to uh, Representative Valadeo's district to see what's happening on the ground in his district with his uh, his own family, with his agricultural users. Now, the agreement calls for the reduction of 3 million acre feet of water by Arizona, California, and Nevada by 2026. Now, it is still pending federal approval. The Southern Nevada Water Authority says Nevada's reductions will be around a quarter of its current allotment, but that our current water conservation efforts mean we won't notice much of an impact on our daily lives. Now, the Bureau of Reclamation expects Lake Mead water levels to rise another 15 to 20 feet through the end of this year. Now, it is helpful, yes, but it's a far cry from solving this water crisis we are facing. So Susie Lee says this agreement simply gives them enough time to work on a longer-term solution over the next three and a half years.